alone. Say, hut. I'm going this way. I'm going this way. This way. This way. My maker. What's good, everybody? And we're back. And today, Team of the Year just dropped in the Madden 21 Ultimate Team, and we're going to be using Russell Wilson from that promo. Now, what Russell Wilson gets as abilities is QB playmaker and gunslinger now the only other quarterback in the game that's able to get those two is Dak prescott from the team of the week promo so i wanted to try out wilson and then we're also going to be playing with darren waller who just got another upgrade from that promo as well so that's our new tight end it fits in well with our raiders theme team but we're not going to show the rest of the lineup today so uh let's jump into the game all right here we go with this one this is actually my first day using playmaker for the entire man 21 so we're gonna do our best today sometimes i may have a tendency to throw the ball to the other team for an interception but well, we're gonna do our best today here we go and we're gonna be starting this one on offense so as i mentioned this is my first time using playmaker for this year in man 21 so if you see me if you see me a little bit more focused maybe a little bit less talking during this video that's probably why we're actually gonna look to use it this first play here playmaker back Ooh, ooh! all right let's go randy moss i'm a, a first play of the game i'm already liking playmaker basically throughout this entire game i'm gonna try to have a drag on the field just so we can probably to have a chance at a playmaker i don't think we need to this time i don't think we need to let's go randy let's go randy randy is exhausted here we've already thrown twice i don't know maybe playmaker might make them a little bit more tired i'm not sure the other possibility could just be that we just took a hit stick with randy moss so i'm just gonna run the ball here try to get our energy back so we can get more playmakers in right because that's kind of what we're looking for throughout the game we haven't used it yet we want to get some practice with it with it we want to use playmaker that's what we're looking for today now the playmaker here will probably be a slant if we end up using it to santana moss so we'll see if it's there if not we just won't use it playmaker back oh okay that was a little bit close but i'm just i'm loving playmaker right now looking for this drag here oh no that that route combo wasn't right that route combo we had the drag going right into the out route that's not what we want to do there and actually you know what on this play i'm actually going to try to playmaker a zig that is what we're looking for here we're going to try to playmaker a zig i have no idea how it's going to look because i haven't really used zigs much this year but we're going to try it and if it if it works it could be cool so that's what we're going to do here we're going to put a cross around the tight end i think it could look what we're actually just going to put two streaks on the outside we're just looking for the zig or we're looking for the cross we'll see how the playmaker goes Let's see if we can play maker back oh i like that if you see the user running out because the runner was the user was running out to the zig so we can kind of just play maker back and their momentum is going to take them the other way now something i actually i meant to note earlier on in the video here is that i probably wouldn't recommend using playmaker uh with your qb the way that i'm doing it because it's seven it's seven ap and then i also feel like if you're passing the ball a lot you kind of need gunslinger so that's 10 ap on russell wilson right there so you really only have two ap for the rest of the team so the only other thing that we have is a uh, tight end apprentice so when you're doing those things you gotta keep in mind that you might not be able to fit everything that you want if you're going to use that qb playmaker so it's not something i recommend Deion sanders at wide receiver can get playmaker now you're only gonna be able uh, to, to playmaker that one player but that's another option for you if you're interested in using it but i have been liking playmaker so far i just don't know if it's worth using up all like 10 of your cap or well, seven of that and then uh three on your gunslinger so i think we have our post here just something I wanted to note for you all if you're interested in using Playmaker to keep that in mind. All right, now we're looking for our out route to our tight end or we're looking for this Playmaker Zig. Playmaker Zig. Oh, Playmaker the other player. That's the thing though. That's the thing. I got to make sure to I got to make sure to keep in mind if I have a player that could be Playmaker as opposed to the one that I want to Playmaker that's closer to me because it's just going to Playmaker the closest receiver. I got to make sure to make sure uh, that I'm doing the right one. So kind of have to keep that in mind if I'm planning on Playmaker during a play to keep players away from them. So... Looking for slander post right here. Playmaker back. Oh, I'm, I'm loving Playmaker. I am loving Playmaker. I don't really see what a user can do to stop that because the user has to keep running with the slant. If they don't run with the slant, I can just throw it normally. So if they're running that way and their momentum is going that way, they kind of just keep following and I can Playmaker it back. And that is that is awesome. I am loving Playmaker. I, I, I haven't used this all year and I'm loving this ability so far. Let's see if we can get in the end zone with Camara. No, we might have to pass the ball here. We might have to pass the ball. I'm loving this ability though it's definitely worth a look if you haven't tried it yet but again i just want you to keep in mind that it's going to take up a lot of your abilities uh your ap so you might want to try to fit some other stuff in there as well i think we have our hitch on the outside bow 
Great catch, Bo! They're gonna be coming out on this gun A slot offset, which is honestly, it's giving me trouble for pretty much years in Madden. Nice dot right there. It's giving me trouble for years. I have trouble stopping the pass out of it. It has good runs. Gives me a lot of trouble. So we'll see how we can do this game. Gotta watch for that user streak against a run play. Ooh, Shanti making plays. I wanna make sure to take away that seam streak this time. I'm watching it. Ooh, nice read, nice read. All right, we have a big third down coming up. I'm looking to lurk this in route right here. No, nah, they got the slant. Nice play again. Nice play again. We're struggling here to get a stop right now. They're kind of dotting us. Ooh, oh, Shanti, Shanti. I fell for that pump fake. I definitely fell for that pump fake. I thought they were throwing it. They did it. Shanti makes the play. All right, now the slant here is the playmaker on this place. We have to watch where I think we have our post going deep though. Playmaker back actually. Oh, we have the post. No, we. I thought we had that post. Going over top there. We threw it too late. We threw it too late. That is completely my fault. We had it open. We had it open. So we're actually going to go right back to that play right here. Make it back with the slant. I think we have the post this time. I think we have the post this time. Randy, Randy, Randy Moss. Let's go. The goal here on this drive is to keep everything in front. Try to prevent any points before half. Oh, oh, oh. Oops. Oh, Michael Vick. Oh, Okay, that was close. That was close. Now they're kind of close to field goal range here. Now, instead of the goal being keeping everything in front, we kind of have to give up no more yards. Otherwise, we're probably going to give up a field goal. So, oh, oh, oh. That, yeah, yep, 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 yep. Oh, thank you for making that tackle. I was not there whatsoever. The run is definitely in play here to try to get to a field goal. Okay, it's going to be a pass, but they can't run the ball because they have the timeout. So they kind of have the whole playbook at their disposal. And that's, oh, that's a good scramble right there. I think 40 yards is probably close to field goal range, if not field goal range already. So again, the run is in play. I'm going to try to send some pressure right here. That's actually what we're going to do. We're going to try to send some pressure, see if we can knock them out of field goal range. We're playing hard flats right here. We got some pressure. We got some pressure. Let's go. Now we can play a little bit more conservative. We just want to keep everything in front here again. Oh, let's go. We got a block shed. Yes. And that is actually going to do it. Great game to our opponent. We're on to game two. All right, here we go with game two. I actually love Playmaker in that first one. We'll see if we can continue to enjoy it in this game. Here we go. And we're gonna be starting this one on defense. They're coming out in the gun bunch, which is a very effective passing formation. You can see that they actually have a good run right there too. We're gonna have to be adjusting to what they're doing throughout the game, pass the ball and running the ball. They're audibly in the bunch tight end now. This is something that gives me a lot of trouble because I, I, I just have had trouble with this uh, formation pretty much every single year. And there's a dot right there. I have trouble with this formation every single year. So we're gonna have to worry about the gun bunch and the gun bunch tight end. Now they're audibly over to what looks like gun trips tight end. Oh, that's a little bubble screen. Good tackle, good tackle. It's a little bubble screen. They're gonna be audibly around it a lot, it looks like. So we're gonna have to continue to adjust for whatever formation they're going to. This is a big third down early on in this game. Just gonna try to lurk the middle of the field. Let's go, great block shit, let's go! This looks like it could be man coverage right here. We do have a possible playmaker drag on the tight end. And we have our post right, okay, it's not. Playmaker back, yes, I'm loving, I, I love this playmaker, I love this playmaker. I, honestly, I really wanna kinda stick with this QB playmaker. It's just gonna be really tough to stick with it without any of the other abilities that we're able to use, but I am loving what you're able to do just with how you can kind of take the user who's running the other way and take their momentum and kind of work them back the other way uh, of the field. So it's really, really nice. We're gonna try to get here with the slant. Let's go Santana Moss. We're going back to the same look here with the slanter post. They make her back. Let's go slant. Let's go slant Santana Moss. I'm loving it. Uh, Santana Moss is doing great on this. The tight end is doing great on it. Randy Moss has done great on it. I'm loving it. We're going, we're actually looking, the playmaker here is going to be to Randy Moss. We're motioning over on a drag here. So Randy Moss is the playmaker. Then we have, we have a corner out on the right side. We've got some other looks with it. We'll see what we can do with it. They make her back. Randy, Randy, Randy. I got to be careful. I got to be careful not to throw it too early. They usually will beat the man coverage on that playmaker back. But if you throw it a little bit early, they can make a play on it. We're looking for our skinny post right here, or we're looking for our slant. They make her back. Nope, no, no. The playmaker, the other one. Throw the ball away. We got to throw the ball away there. Again, I mentioned in the first game, if they have a player out, if we have a player out there that's closer than the player that we want to playmaker, it can kind of, it can throw us off a little bit. So we have to look out for that. We're going to this play. We're looking for the tight end on the outside. Not going to have it. They make it back on the drag. Let's go, Santana. Let's go, baby. And way to reach for it. Let's go. We're looking for our option or our hitch right here. Neither. We've got neither. We've got neither. They send pressure again. We need to make a quick read out of the backfield. They didn't. Ooh, I thought we might have had the tight end right there. We might have. Just try to get some here with Kamara. Just try to get some here. Third and goal from the third tee. That's going to be tough. We're either looking for our seam streaks or a playmaker right here. Nah, we don't have, we, we have neither. We have neither. 
See if we can get a reroute. Nothing. I want to make you mistakes. And I want to make you mistakes right here. We're just going to take our three. That is cool. We'll take our field goal. We'll see if we can get another stop. Oh, nice laser. Nice laser. Yeah, I'll put over to this trips now. We have to continue to adjust because they're going to a lot of different formations, which is good. It's keeping us on our toes. Laser again right there. We have to continue to watch the, all, the, all the formations they're going to because they can do a lot of different things out of each one. They're also doing a good job of mixing up which side they're coming out on. Wide side, short side, which depending on which hash that they're on. That's also keeping me on my toes as well. So I have to continue to try to adjust to whatever it is that they're doing. And just, I'm, I'm staying with this man coverage. So I feel like the man coverage has played pretty well. But again, we can't we can't stick with that if we're going to get dotted throughout the whole game. So we kind of have to just be aware of what they're doing and try to do our best to stop it. We're actually going to send some pressure right here. We're going to try to knock them out of field goal range if possible. We didn't get any pressure. That's okay. We made a tackle. We didn't get any pressure. They're likely going to get a field goal right here unless we can force a turnover. But we wanted to try to force... We wanted to try to get them to take a sack right there to see if we can knock them out of field goal range. And they're going to end up taking their three here. But we do have about 20 seconds here to try to get some type of points out of it. We have a couple timeouts. We'll see what we can do. Looking to go deep here with our skinny post, but then we also have the playmaker slant. The maker back. We're gonna take a timeout right here. We're gonna take a timeout. I'm hoping we can roll out to the left right here. And we have this post. Santana, great toe tap. Clock's running. We're gonna let it run down to three seconds here. We're able, we're gonna be able to get our field goal off. But let's go. That was a great catch from Santana Moss right there. We really needed that to be able to take the lead. Before halftime right here, let's see, let's see if we can make this field goal first. But again, that was a big time catch right there. So we're going to go into halftime with the lead. It's actually going to be our ball at half as well. So we'll see what we can do. Looking for our tight end crosser right here. We also have this drag that we can possibly play maker back. See, that's what I was talking about right there. We actually have the crosser, but that's what I was talking about right there. If you saw, I'll actually show on the replay here on that playmaker back. Initially, they were guarded by the man coverage. I'm not sure if they would have gotten open late there, but if I had thrown it on the initial cut, like I've done a couple of times and been a little bit close on, that could have been an interception. I'm hoping they don't send any pressure right here. They did. We have the table route, though. We have the table route. Camara, Camara. Oh, that was so close. Looking for the same thing right here. We might have our table route out of the backfield again. We do. We do. Can we stay in bounds this time? We can't. Camara, Camara. Let's go. I'm really liking this setup right here that, we're being go that we've been going to. Oh, no. They came through. No, they forced a fumble. Thank you for getting it back they got right through on that play right there all right we're gonna we're gonna change up right here because they they were all over that they were all over that play right there i didn't see anything open and they came right through and they they made a big time play right there so we're looking slander post right here we're looking slander post and make her back Ooh, I, see i can't i can't get in the habit of only utilizing the playmaker because right there i feel like i could have just probably throwing the slant so i don't want to be throwing near the user like that we're gonna go back to the same play but if they don't use the slant i kind of just need to take it when it's initially open so we'll look we'll see what they do and uh oh we have the post we have the post no we don't have the post oh do we take a field goal here fourth and 12. i think i think the field goal is the play i feel like the field goal is the play this is gonna be our third field goal but i fourth and 12 is tough to pick up fourth and 12 is really tough to play up pick up because in years past when they didn't have the zone drops you could usually just like throw a, a deep corner out or throw a deep crosser to pick up 12 yards easily but now if they set their zone drops, you're kind of just having to... Playmakers really are only option to get that first down. So I feel like taking the field goal is the right play. We'll see if we can get a stop. All right, we're going to see if we can try to get a stop right here. They're coming out of this single back, which I don't think they've done this entire game. So it's going to be something new probably. Maybe a run play. They've got some good passes out of these single backs a lot of the time too. That was a nice crosser. Watching for Bo. Nope, nothing out of the backfield. Let's go. Watching this right side right here. Looking. Oh, can we get a knockout on that? Nice. Flood is such a tough play to stop. I feel like you can throw those, that out route and that in route pretty much every single time against man coverage. So we're, re we're, we're rarely ever going to get a knockout against that. So that's a really nice play right there. I'm going to have to watch from that from now on. I think that was the first time that they actually called Flood this game, at least that I can remember. So I'm going to be watching for it for the rest of the game. If I see that out route going out to the left, I will jump to the left and we'll have a vertical hook on the right side to try to stop the in route. Watching for it here. It's not there this time. Up and back. Let's go. I thought I thought we had that. They're going back to this bunch tight end here. We have to watch for any delay fades. No, no delay fades. Ooh, nice dot outside. Oh, no. We didn't get our adjustment. We didn't get our adjustments in. Nice read. We didn't get our adjustments in. Nice play. This is a big drive right here. We really don't want to give up seven on this drive. Watching this middle. Oh, that's another laser. That is another laser. I just said we didn't want to give up seven on this drive. We proceed to give up seven 
on this drive. So great dot by them. Great dot. We're going to be going down to nine here, pending this extra point. We're in the fourth quarter now. So we kind of, we got to put a drive together. If we could take the rest of the clock and kick a field goal, that'd be great. If not, we really need a touchdown. Looking for our crosser or our drag right here. We can playmaker the drag if we need to. Playmaker back. Let's go, Jerry. Let's go, Jerry. Nice job. Nice job, Jerry. Looking for our post going across the field here. We don't have it. I got nothing here. We kind of got nothing. We're just looking to make a play. We can just run. We'll run with Russell. We'll run with Russell. Don't take any hits because we, we don't want to make our quarterback tired. If you take hit sticks with your quarterback, that's going to make them really tired a lot of the time. Plus, we just ran around a lot. So Russell's probably going to be tired anyway. So we definitely didn't want to take that hit stick right here. And we don't really have to worry too much about the clock here. We only need a field goal. So if we end up taking the entire clock and getting a field goal, that is perfectly fine. But if we don't get, if we don't take the rest of the clock and we end up getting a field goal, that puts us in a really tough spot. So it's kind of, it's a tough call here. We either want to take the rest of the clock and get a field goal, or we'd like to get a touchdown. And if we leave them time, that's a little bit okay. Ooh, really great user. Really great user. I think we have Randy. Randy! Randy with a great toe tap. All right, now we're in field goal range here. We're, now, so basically, yeah, now we're in the spot where we can take the rest of the clock, but if we can't, we will take our touchdown. So either way, let this player go go around because I don't want them run, shooting the gap. If you call a run play with defensive players moving, a lot of the times it helps them to play the run. They just start shooting the gap right away. So I wanted to wait for that player to get manned up with their player. Then we ran the inside zone. Ah, that was close. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about. We playmakered and we threw it too early and that ends up being a very very scary pass right there third and seven this is a big play this is kind of the spot that i was talking about where if we take our field goal and leave time it puts us in a, puts us in a really tough spot so we kind of get it we kind of get a first down right here we kind of have to oh the slant santana great catch i think i was a little bit late on that read i wasn't sure if they had a cloud flat on the right there but it ended up being a hard flat we're able to make the catch but now it's going to be a really hard clock out we they have all three of their timeouts and to get a first down we'd have to be at like the half yard line so i'm gonna let this clock run all the way down but we kind of have to get a touchdown now to be in the best spot we can be hopefully we get a few yards right here we did not they have inside stuff i didn't realize that now we're in a tough spot in the red zone second and 13. ideally here if we do have to settle for three all the plays are inbounds and not incompletions so that we can take the rest of their timeouts because they'd have about a minute left no timeouts that's a tougher to get a field goal uh than if they had timeouts so we'll see here and back up with a slant. No, 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 no. Yes, 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 yes. Woo, that was scary. That was scary. That that slant was open on the playmaker, but I threw it a little bit late. And we ended up getting to throw out a sack. But Santana Moss makes the play. So we were able to do what we wanted to do, which was keep everything in bounds and not be an incompletion. And we definitely do not want to throw an interception right here. But third and nine. We, we have to get in here. We're probably going to take our three. Can we ever post? Darren Waller. Yes. All right. They have a minute 04 left, but they have one timeout. So, oh, oh no, okay, you know what? I don't think we need our timeouts. I, I, we should go for two, but I didn't call the right play. We, we need to go for two here, but we need to get our best play out there possible. If they don't send pressure, we should probably have our running back, but if they do, we might be in some trouble. I think we have our running back, Kamara, yes! Okay, we have our seven point lead now, minute 04 left. They have one timeout, which they have time. They have time, but we wanna try to keep everything in front during this drive. We don't wanna give any big plays. We'll probably mix in some more zone than we have been during the game. We'll still play some man coverage, but we'll mix in some more zone. You uh, Utilize those zone drops I was talking about before to prevent people from getting big plays. 20 to 25 yard flats, and we can kind of go from there. We're shading up right now as well to make sure we don't give up any streaks down the field. We get a knockout on that. Great job, great knockout. We're mixing in zone now. We're not gonna be in man coverage. I'm watching for this out route. Oh, oh, great job knocking out. That was a little bit scary, I actually thought. They might have had that. All right, third and 10. This is another big play here. We're going to go back to the man coverage just because I feel like they just saw a zone, so we're going we're gonna to give them a different look. We're going to continue to mix up our looks. We're shading up. Make sure we don't beat, get beat deep. I'm watching this out route. And they have the in route yet. Yeah, the in routes and the out routes out of flood are really, really good against man coverage. I have to watch for them the entire time. I kind of have to have a zone on that side and then user the other. One way or the other, we need a zone and our user. Watching this right side. Oh, no. We didn't get our adjustment in properly. Oh, another dot. Clock's gonna run here though. They're out of timeouts. They're gonna spike it. 23 seconds again. We just wanna keep everything in front. No big plays. We're shaded up again here. We wanna keep everything in front of us. One more tackle and balance should probably put us in a great position to win the game. Oh no. Oh no, that is such a dot. It's in bounds though. Is the clock gonna run out? Is the clock gonna run out? Yes, it will. That was such a laser by them. Let's go. All right, we're able to get the win. 
Great game to our opponent. Amazing game. That came down to the very end right there. Great dot. So great games to both of our opponents. I hope you all enjoyed the video. And if you did, please remember to like, comment, subscribe. Only if you want to. I love you all. Take it easy. Peace. Playmaker.